Let's crack it with it, everybody, man. Um, this is another one, man. Um, just trying to figure this thing out, man. I ruffled some feathers with that last one I made about uh, do Sudanios uh, get to um, snitch on blacks. I'm not going to speak too much more on that, but again, I did hear that a few different times. I wonder where it came from, how it came, who started it why it was started it sounds kind of crazy and again i haven't heard anybody brother come forward and say they was doing time or they got snitched on by some south siders so i'm gonna let that rest until i hear some shit like that but i just like to wonder man uh what did all the hatred start for niggas especially in the california penal code system man and i hear a lot of stories about other prisons around the United States and they're not as uh, segregated as uh, California uh, prisons are. Maybe New York is. You got all your your Puerto Ricans, your, your Haitians and all those different kind of uh, sets and cars. But here in California, we just got the, you know, the big black cars, the white cars, the Mexican cars, the Native American cars, the Asian cars, and, you know, and stuff like that. And, uh, seemed like everybody be hating on the niggas, man. The Asians run with the blacks in the penitentiary. They don't really run with them, but they're kind of like, uh, allied with the blacks in prison in, in the California penal code system. Uh, we call them the others, the agents, the Samoans, the Pacific Islanders, anybody on that level, Puerto Ricans or anything like that, they will be considered others. And they would be kind of uh, 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 allied with the blacks, but still they're on their own. It could be a nigga that look like a nigga. He'll claim a other just so he won't have to run with the niggas and deal with the nigga politics and shit. And so... Everybody's against the niggas, man. We used to have a thing with the Northanios back in the day, the Northern Mexicans back in the day, and and it's not so no more, you know. Um, it's not so no more, and I don't know where that came from, and I don't know. I, I remember when I told the story, if y'all heard me tell the story of the guy, he was some bounty hunters, and uh, we almost got into it, the Northanios, because he stole one of the Northanios' uh, radio, and... Uh, and uh, we really didn't DP the motherfucker after that. The, the the bounty hunter car was a little thicker than the rest of the bloods on the yard at that time. So the bounty hunter didn't uh, DP him. So we didn't DP him. Nobody DPs a bounty hunter but a bounty hunter. You know how that goes. Don't fuck with them hunters. So um, so maybe they was mad at us because they didn't fuck with us no more after that. So I wonder where the hatred come from. We know niggas can be assholes. Niggas can be assholes. Niggas can be real assholes. And I wonder, did that start? Uh, motherfuckers stop fuck with niggas be get uh, niggas be bullying motherfuckers a lot. Every race got their bullies and all that old shit. But I, you know, when I see niggas doing, I be like, God damn, we come from a motherfuckers that bullied us. Why do we want to be that way? And um, yeah, niggas be some motherfucking bullies and shit. And um, um, I can see other races not fucking with us on that level. You know, motherfuckers get cool with us and we do something wrong to fuck that off and shit. And I can see that happening. But I don't know where the hatred come from because the, the Southern Mexicans, they hate us. You know, they don't fuck with us like that in the pen. And, and I, you know, especially the whites, even the Native Americans don't fuck with us. And I don't understand why the Native Americans don't fuck with us. And I'm thinking this maybe because of the Buffalo Soldiers things. You know, the Buffalo Soldiers, how they, they fought with the white men trying to catch Indians and shit like that. They had black... Indian catchers and slave catchers and all this old type shit. So, you know, I think the Native American was hating on the Buffalo Soldiers. I was hating on. So I, I was hearing something about that because, you know, I don't know. So I, I don't know. The, even the Native Americans they ride with the whites and the uh, Southern Mexicans in prison against the blacks and shit. The blacks are always outnumbered. Even the motherfucking asshole, you know. Um, the cops up in the penitentiary, they're geared towards more of the other uh, races and shit like that. I done heard them giving the other races knives and helping them out and shit like that. Lying, covering up for other races against the blacks and shit. And I just wonder, wonder where all the hatred comes from. Is it because niggas are just assholes? Uh, or is it because we hate on each other? You know, and it's easier to hate on us when we hate on ourselves and shit like that. We're so evil towards each other. I don't... 
I don't know where all the hate hate comes from, man. And uh, 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 um, uh, now the Mexicans are clicking up, right? In the penitentiaries and shit. The North and the South shoot the funk, and now they're clicking up. And and uh, why niggas can't see that and start doing something and shit? And I was in a penitentiary. I was seeing, oh, well, I was hearing about other brothers letting other brothers get jumped on, getting beat down, stabbed, whatever the fuck about about uh, other races and shit like that, not jumping in. And, and other brothers talking about, oh, you know, then we that he's from another car and shit like that. But another car, the black car should be one thing, man. The black car should be one thing. We should be protecting one another. I don't know how they let that type of shit happen, but it's going down. And, and that's probably why other races can't respect us. We let shit like that happen and shit like that. If we was all one and, and, and loving on each other like we should be, instead of always talking down on a, uh, the next motherfucker, niggas talking about fucking another motherfucker, bitch, and taking from another nigga and all that talk, type of shit. What if you put uh, uh, the term my brother in front of the word nigga? And use that in all the lyrics to take nigga out and put my brother in. It sound a little different, and you probably wouldn't be so handy to do something real drastic towards your brother and shit like that. You know, I don't know, man. Where does all the hatred come from from all these other races for niggas? What do we do and shit like that? And it's because, you know what I'm saying, most of the time we be bullying bullies and shit like that when our numbers get deep and shit like that. And I don't know. You know, in the penitentiary, a lot of times, it'd be a lot of, the shot callers with the niggas be a lot of, a, a lot of dope being shot callers, man. They didn't got off the dope and got their weight on and shit like that. And they doing, uh, 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 calling shots in the penitentiary and doing some dumb ass shit. And they call it some crazy ass shot in the penitentiary. And I've seen that a lot of time with the brothers. They'd be dope fiends calling the shots. And there'd be a lot of that with a lot of races. It'd be a like dope fiends calling the shots. There'd be a lot of bullshit going on and shit like that. Cause they chasing that motherfucking bag, man. And so... I don't know, man. I don't know. Where does all the hatred come from with all the niggas, man? And, uh, you know, a long time ago, we used to see, I mean, when I was in penitentiary, we used to clown on people being on medication and shit, going up to pill call and shit like that. Niggas on hot meds and all that old shit, you know, getting us off to crowd over that motherfucking straw hat and all this old shit, getting you your bag of ice. We was clowning motherfuckers like that, going to pill call and shit. There wasn't too many motherfuckers. I went to penitentiary a few years ago, you know, did have to do a little quick stint, and uh, I haven't been in penitentiary for years, and all them youngsters was going to pill call, when they got pill call, everybody wanted some fucking pills, everybody's on motherfucking pills and shit, and then we used to clown that shit, the motherfuckers on hot meds and all that old crazy ass shit, and, and uh, everybody's on it now, it's crazy, man, I mean, I don't know, man, I don't know, man, the world is going to hell in a handbasket, man, and uh, Niggas calling each other bitches and shit like that, disrespecting each other and shit like that. Like niggas in California, we never used the word ops and shit. All of a sudden, we're using ops. You know what I'm saying? That's somebody else's shit. You know what I'm saying? The, we used to say the enemy and shit like that. Now we, I don't know, man. I don't know. Where does the hatred come from niggas out there in the California penitentiaries? If anybody know, please chime in, man. Let's get the conversation started, man. And, uh, uh, uh you know. I just want to know, man. I just want to know, man, because, you know, it should be all about one love and shit like that, you know, and, you know, it shows a, a, a little love when he, we see these Mexicans clicking up, but the niggas can't even click up, you know, I don't know, man. That's just my take on a lot of shit. Where does all the niggas come from? Let's get to, I mean, where does all the hating comes from with the niggas and shit like that? It's hurtful is what it is, you know, it's hurtful is what it is, man, and uh, it's crazy, you know. You know, other races like the whites, uh, the Native Americans, uh, they don't fuck with niggas, uh, the uh, Southern Mexicans, they can't even accept much shit from blacks. And it's kind of it's kind of hurtful is what it is, man. It's very hurtful, man. And uh, you got to kind of be strong. You brother up in there trying to, you know, hold your macho shit up, you know, trying to be. But it's hurtful is what it is, man. It's kind of hurtful, embarrassing and all that. When did that start? Why is it like that? They can't accept shit from blacks, not a cigarette or nothing like that. And I know y'all heard this, uh, if y'all didn't seen the story that I put, uh, when I was in Quentin, when the white asked, white dude asked me for some soups, I was surprised about that, because that wasn't allowed back then. And it's crazy, man, it's crazy, man, because brothers accept other races into their cliques and crews and shit like that, but other races, like the Southsiders and the whites don't accept brothers into their they cliques. Southsiders used to, I've I seen some 18th Street cats and 
you know, some some brothers that was uh, 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 South Siders and shit like that. If the riot was started, you know, everybody said, I'm going to get them niggas. But y'all don't know. That's, that's some bullshit. But anyway, anyway, uh, uh, other brothers except any other race and they uh, 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 click and uh, fight and die for them and shit like that. But other races don't. So that shows you where the hatred really is. It's just, I don't know, where did that come from, man? Where did that hatred with, with, with brother with the South Side? And, and, and the south side not fucking with brothers in the penitentiary what did that start you know i, I really like to know that man and uh and you know with the whites that's just the, you know we, we cannot understand the white shit but still we all in prison and other prisons around the u.s don't really trip like that and why is it in california that we trip like that and everybody wants to be in california like california's all free and shit like that but in prison you really see how california really is motherfuckers really on some hatred shit you know what I'm saying? Towards each races. You know what I'm saying? And and uh, don't get me wrong. I love how the, the Mexicans are getting together, the North and the South. And they're, they're, they're starting to, you know what I'm saying, ally up and shit like that. I love that shit. That's what they're supposed to do. Niggas need to do that. We need to learn from that shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Because, you know, it, I don't know. It started somewhere. You know, what is the hatred? You know, you know wh why is it like that? You know, and, 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 and it is because, you know, sometimes we're a lot more weaker when it comes to trying to, hold our own as far as uh uh discipline in our own and shit like that do niggas check paperwork and shit like that and uh it wasn't really like that when i was up in there you know and they check paperwork and shit like that and uh we really were more laid back we're rolling people up you know what i'm saying when it comes to foul business and shit like that just like i told y'all the story of, of my man's uh uh, still in the stereo from the Northeno and shit and fucked off our uh, ally and our relationship with the Northeno's when I was up in there. I don't know. Where does the hatred come from, man? I don't know. Especially with the North and the South. I mean, not the North and the Southern and the Blacks and shit like that. And I don't know. Where, where does the hatred come from and, and why is it like that? That's Rock B, three on the tree. Just a little curious, man. Holler at me. Let's talk about it.